Jeffrey Michael Tambor is an American actor and voice actor, best known for his roles as Hank Kingsley on The Larry Sanders Show, as well as George Bluth Sr. and Oscar Bluth on Arrested Development. Most recently, he has portrayed Maura Pfefferman on Transparent, for which he received the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Comedy Series and the Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in a television series, musical or comedy in 2015. Early Life Tambor was born in San Francisco, California, the son of Eileen, a housewife, and Michael Bernard, Mike, Tambor, a flooring contractor. He grew up in a conservative Jewish family with roots in Hungary and KYIV, Ukraine. Tambor is a graduate of San Francisco State University where he studied acting and then went on to receive a master's degree from Wayne State University. Career Early career Tambor first moved to Repertory Theatre in Milwaukee, later making his Broadway debut in the comedy Sly Fox, appearing with George C. Scott and directed by Arthur Penn. He appeared in Measure for Measure in the same year. In 1979 he starred in Norman Jewison's And Justice for All as a lawyer friend of the protagonist, Arthur Kirkland. In an early TV job, an ad for Avis Rent-A-Car, he was seen running through an airport, mocking O.J. Simpson's Go, J. Go ads for Hertz. He has had a significant career in episodic TV, where he made numerous guest appearances on different shows, including Taxi, Kojak, M Asterisk KSH, The Golden Girls, and Three's Company. In 1979 Tambor got his first role as a main character in television in the short-lived show The Ropers. Throughout the 1980s Tambor had a recurring role on Hill Street Blues playing a defense attorney who eventually becomes a judge. In 1981 he appeared in an episode of Barney Miller, where he appeared as a man who was trying to bring exposure to the members of the Trilateral Commission in charge of the coming New World Order. The names David Rockefeller, James Earl Carter, Henry Kissinger, Walter Mundale, John Anderson, George H. W. Bush are mentioned in relation to the United States presidential election, 1980. In 1987 and 1988, Tambor appeared as a regular on the primetime ABC series Max Headroom as Murray, Edison's editor. The Larry Sanders show Tambor is often remembered as Hank Kingsley, the narcissistic sidekick of fictional talk show host Larry Sanders on The Larry Sanders Show. Tambor received four Emmy nominations for his performance on the show, all of which he would lose, to Michael Richards for Seinfeld, David Hyde Pierce for Frasier, and his co-star, Rip Torn. He is also often remembered for Kingsley's then-famous catchphrase, Hey Now, Arrested Development, beginning in 2003. Tambor starred in the television comedy Arrested Development as George Bluth, Sr., and in some episodes as his twin brother Oscar Bluth. The show was cancelled in 2006, after three seasons, but a fourth season was released on Netflix in 2013. In 2004, Tambor received his fifth Emmy nomination for his work on the show. He lost to David Hyde Pierce for the final season of the sitcom Frasier. Tambor was nominated for a sixth time in 2005 but lost to Brad Garrett for the final season of Everybody Loves Raymond. The second episode of Arrested Development's third season lampooned this loss. Tambor's character's son describes his acting ability by saying, It's a wonderful performance, Dad. You're a regular Brad Garrett, later work Tambor served as the announcer for the game show Hollywood Squares in 2002 and 2003. He was also the voice of King Neptune in 2004's The SpongeBob SquarePants movie. In the spring of 2005, he starred as George Aronow in the Broadway revival of Glen Gary Glen Ross. After the cancellation of Arrested Development in April 2006, Tambor signed on to a series with John Lithgow called 20 Good Years about two men who ponder the last 20 years of their life. The show premiered on NBC on October 11, 2006 but was taken off the air after only a few episodes.
Also in 2006, he portrayed George Washington on the radio adventures of Dr. Floyd. He also starred as Uncle Saul in the CBS comedy Welcome to the Captain until its cancellation in March 2008. He has made several cameo appearances in Entourage as a fictionalized version of himself who regularly annoys his agent, Ari Gold. For several years, based on his availability, Tambor has also taught a popular class for actors. He was formerly a longtime teaching associate of famed acting coach Milton Katzales. In 2009, Tambor appeared in the animated film Monsters vs. Aliens and in the comedy The Hangover. A role Tambor began in 2009 is that of the recurring character Len Trexler in the sardonic comedy Archer, an animated television series on the FX network. He is a major love interest to Mallory Archer played by Jessica Walter, the two formerly playing husband and wife in Arrested Development. Tambor replaced Kelsey Grammer as George in the Broadway revival of the musical La Cajo Follis on February 15, 2011, but withdrew from the production after the February 24 performance. Also in 2011, Tambor starred in an indie comedy, Lucky. That same year, he had a minor role in the film Paul with Simon Pegg and Nick Frost, reprised his hangover role for its sequel, and was featured in Fly Paper, with Patrick Dempsey and Ashley Judd. In 2012, he co-starred as Walt, Pete's aspiring musician father on the sitcom band starring Amanda Pete and David Walton. In May 2013 he returned to season 4 of Arrested Development. Transparent in February 2014, Amazon premiered its original series Transparent, which stars Tambor as a transgender, divorced, Jewish father turned mother of three. Tambor won the Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in a Television Series, Musical or Comedy for his portrayal and thanked the transgender community. In the midst of his speech, he won the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Comedy Series for his performance in Season 1 of the show, his first win in seven Primetime Emmy Award nominations, following nominations for The Larry Sanders Show and Arrested Development. This makes him the first actor to win an Emmy for portraying a transgender character. Personal life Tambor has five children. His oldest child, Molly Tambor, was born on July 5, 1975. He has four children with Karsha Erslin, whom he married in October 2001. Tambor's second child and first grandchild were born within a few days of each other in December 2004. His wife Kasha gave birth to son Gabriel Casper on December 10, 2004, and his daughter Molly Tambor gave birth to son Mason J. Moore on December 14, 2004. On December 10, 2006, his wife gave birth to their second child, daughter Eve Julia. In 2007, Tambor was reported to be a Scientologist. However, in February 2008, Tambor expressed concern about internet reports about his alleged involvement with the religion and stated that he took some Scientology classes, at one time, studied Scientology for a while, but no more. I have nothing against it, but I am no longer a Scientologist. On the Late Late Show with Craig Ferguson on June 3, 2009, Tambor announced his wife was pregnant with twin boys due in October 2009. The boys, Hugo Bernard and Eli Nicholas, were born on October 4, 2009. Tambor is a Democrat and supported President Barack Obama in his re-election campaign in 2012. Filmography